Good evening everyone. We have a very special guest in our New York studio tonight. He is Estonia's Prime Minister Andrus Ansip. Thank you for being with us tonight Andrus Ansip. Thank you for inviting me. Andrus Ansip, Estonia is a very small country. In the middle of European debt crisis, has it been hard to explain to Estonian taxpayers that some Eurozone countries need to be bailed out? If all countries would be fiscally conservative like Estonia, there would be no debt crisis. How are Estonians looking at this? Yes. It has been so much hard to explain to Estonians that we need to deal with the program in Eurozone. Estonian people are very hard working, and they do not like borrowing and borrowing. They want to spend only what they own. At the same time they understand that there needs to be solidarity in Eurozone. So it has been so much hard to explain but they understand. Apparently there are some angry Estonian teachers demonstrating outside our studio right now. We'll take a break, but stay tuned. We will continue with this interview with Estonian Prime Minister. Welcome back everyone. We will continue with our interview with our very special guest tonight, Estonia's Prime Minister Andrus Ansip. We had some angry Estonian teachers earlier demonstrating outside our studio. Their banners haven't been removed yet from our window, but the demonstrators were pepper sprayed and arrested. Can you tell us Andrus Ansip, are they angry because not every Eurozone country is fiscally conservative like Estonia? Are they patriots of Estonia's economic policy? Yes, I think so. Andrus Ansip, can you tell us in America how has Estonia pulled it off? How has Estonia managed to live within its means? We only spend what we earn. It is simple reality. What do you say to those Keynesian economists who say that economy needs to be stimulated? What do you say to those who say that unemployment gets high and there is going to be drop in economic output if government doesn't deficit spend? I say, do not do it. Look at Estonia, we do not stimulate. We do not care about unemployment, we do not care about economic output dropping. I think we all should learn from little Estonia. Thank you for being with us tonight Andrus Ansip. Good luck to Estonia. Good luck to Andrus Ansip. Thank you very much.